much a swim. Hey Emma, I'm just going down to the cafe to check if they've got internet. Oh, hey, hey George. Hey, how are you doing, how are you? Are you training? Of course, as always. I need to go to Leida Stadts urgently. Could one of uh, you guys borrow me your mountain bike? That would be great. You can sure. Mine. Let's go. Hello everybody and welcome to Breitling Second Summit webcast. We are here in Leiderstadt, close to St. Moritz. It's a beautiful place. Last April we had a first webcast with 2.5 million views when we presented the phenomenal chronomats, the Super Ocean Heritage and the Navitimer 35. But first let me say a few words about the current health crisis. The past few months have certainly been very challenging for each and every one of us. I'm extremely proud that we could support frontline healthcare workers with our Super Ocean Heritage 57 Blue Rainbow Edition. We were able to donate over $700,000 to organizations and charities around the world. Luckily, we are now seeing some of our markets return to a new normal and sales are bouncing back as well. For Breitling, I can be confident for a number of reasons. First, our positioning as casual, inclusive, and sustainable luxury brand will be even more relevant in the months to come. In most markets, we are an established household name with a loyal local customer base, making us less dependent on travel and tourism. We now offer e-commerce in 29 countries around the world with omnichannel features such as boutique appointments, pre-orders, and real-time product availability information. And in just a few weeks, we will upgrade our e-warranty system with blockchain technology, which will give each Breitling watch traceability, transparency, and tradeability. Our collections play in air, land and sea, and we have the Chronomat as an all-purpose watch as well as a professional range. We have now redesigned all core collections. Professional is pure brightening. We have always been about performance, tool watches, being on a mission and creating the best watches for professionals. They are all powered by our super quartz movement, they are super light and they are all super sporty and the emergency is, of course, Breitling Icon. The first and only wristwatch with an integrated personal locator beacon. And today, Professional is venturing even deeper into the dynamic world of sports. In cycling, we sponsor Giro d'Italia and the Tour de France. The same is true in motor racing. And throughout the 40s and 50s, we created special stopwatches with bespoke dials for football, Rowing, boxing, water polo, even ice hockey. We want to continue this legacy. And by now you probably know that we have an incredible squad with us, the Triton Squad. Who better to help me tell you all about the new Breitling Endurance Pro?
Welcome, Daniela. Thank you very much for being with us today. I've heard that you've also had some uh, traffic this morning. Yeah, um, I uh, had some traffic, had to take a shortcut and took a swim here, so it was, was quicker. Yeah, this is uh, how you look like after getting out of the water, is that right? Of course, you don't look like this when you get out of a swim. <laughs> <laughs> Not really. Um, how do you feel with the product? I really love it. Good color, so you don't lose it in a swim bag. You can always see it. I think it's the lightest watch I've ever worn. You know, it's modern and strong, and the combination is really, really great. So we have here the rubber straps in different color uh, executions, and we have the Econil. You prefer rubber or do you prefer this uh, Econil? I do love the Econil. It wears really comfortable on the wrist. And to have something sustainable, it's a great um, thing to do. I think it's an amazing watch. And from the color, I think they all look beautiful. I also really like the white one. It looks very classy, but still sporty. For men, I also think uh, blue uh -huh. is really cool. Talking about men, uh, we have two gentlemen joining us for our talk uh, this morning. One is in Australia, Chris McCormack and of course, Jan Frodeno, and he is in Spain. Good morning, Jan, good morning, Chris. Hey, guys. Hey, good morning, guys. How are you doing? Good morning, George, it's Daniela. Great to see you both. Looks like you've been out training, doing a triathlon or something. Are you feeling okay, George? A bit exhausted? <laughs> you can talk, Maka. None of us are really getting younger. Please remember when you looked like this, and these days, it's more like this. So those heels can be a bit tough, huh, Maka? Holy moly, Maka, you are looking ripped, tanned and fit. Is that really you? Yeah, it's, <laughs> that's me a long time ago. A lot skinnier, but uh, it takes me back, that's for sure, but a long, long time ago. Talking of a step back in time, the Endurance Pro is actually inspired by a 1970s writing watch called Sprint. It combined a pulsometer with being very lightweight and was designed especially for athletes so that they could check their heart rate. That's why it was made from resin to be lighter and more comfortable on the wrist. Yeah, you can see that 70s influence, the design, the colors are, are very retro indeed and the, the changes look amazing. It was you, Jan, that gave me the original idea for the Endurance Pro when you asked me which watch you should wear back when you first became a Breitling ambassador. Really, George? I had no idea. That makes this watch even more special for me. What do you think about the weight of the Endurance Pro? To be honest, it's, it's a little bit ridiculous. I've, I've almost forgotten that I'm wearing it. It's that light. What is it actually made of? It's made from bright light. This incredible material, it's lighter than titanium and totally scratch-proof. Well, you know what? I think it's amazing. I mean, it makes it perfect for every situation to wear. And, well, you never know what might be asked of you, but I'm always there to lend a hand, George, as you know. Oh, that is brilliant. I thought I was the only one that needed a hand that day, George, but it looks like you did too. I thought we had deleted that picture. Thanks again, guys, for helping me introduce the new collection. I really think we all agree that the Endurance Pro is the ultimate sports leisure watch. That brings us to the end of our second webcast. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I have. It has been my pleasure, as always, to share our latest news with all of you. And to introduce the Endurance Pro, of course, a very important step for Breitling. It expands professional in the world of sports while helping confirm our relevance as a casual luxury brand to a new audience. It also underlines Breitling's unique ability to offer such a broad range of watches. You won't have to wait before you can try the Endurance Pro for yourself. The collection will be available from today, both online and in the Brightling stores worldwide. Thank you again for joining, and remember, this is just the beginning.
Hello everybody and welcome to the second Breitling Webcast Summit. No, Webcast. Breitling Second Summit Webcast. Ronnie. So we wait for... Uh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah. That come together in triathlon, for example. Can we redo this because of this yeah, bloody yeah. Uh, fly? I love them all. I think I'll, I personally, I'll, I think I will take uh, all five of them because I know that my family is going to steal these products from me anyway. The, uh, God, no, my I'm dog sorry. is here and he's putting me out of concentration. <laughs> uh, Charlie! We need to restart, I'm sorry. So I do the whole thing again.